Our top story, the Tulsa County Sheriff's Office made a big step in the Turley triple murder case this afternoon. Sheriff Vic Regalado announced prosecutors charged John Brian Good with the murder of Glenda Cookie Parton, Dwayne Selby and Jack Grimes. Two News Oklahoma's Brody Myers was at that news conference today and joins us live now outside the Sheriff's Office. Brody. Naomi, nearly two years after three people went missing, investigators are naming their suspect. Prosecutors have charged John Brian Good with the murders of Parton, Grimes, and Selby. Right now, Sheriff Vic Regalado says the motivations are unclear. You know, motivations are weird. Um, when they're there, it's because it's pretty uh, glaring, like a dope rip or a gangster type of shooting. Uh, and these motives are a little bit more difficult. Only Mr. Good could probably tell you why he did these things. Last month, I spoke on the phone with Carol Selby, the daughter-in-law of Glenda Parton. She could have never guessed a motivation. You know, it was just a surprise to me that anybody would want to hurt her. It was a surprise to me on Jack and Dwayne. That first day, I was like, Cookie, it's okay. There, you know, something happened to a car. We, nobody believed anything like this could happen. Two years ago, shortly before the murders, Good was spotted on surveillance photos with Glenda Parton at a Tulsa area grocery store. Investigators made him a person of interest and brought him in for questioning, then turned him loose. A spokeswoman with the Sheriff's Department tells me he remained a person of interest throughout it all, but at the time of the questioning, they didn't have enough evidence to charge or arrest him. Now that he's charged, Sheriff Regalado and his team are relieved. This is an individual that we believe committed, uh, well, now four murders. And um, so this is somebody that we need off the streets. But um, at the same time, I think the family is probably a little bit more relieved than we are. Selby told me the fact this could happen in a community as small as Turley is even more shocking. I never knew anything about Turley. Um, I know that the house that Jack and Dwayne lived at was uh, Jack's family home. His mama had lived there. Um, I never suspected that there could be anything like that. Brody, so we heard the sheriff mention four murders. What other cases get involved in? He was recently sentenced to prison 32 and a half years in connection with the death of Richard Bonat. So with that in mind, Sheriff Regalado is hoping more people will come forward with information in relation to Mr. Good because he said there is no risk of him coming out of jail. Naomi. Brody, thank you.